Hello and welcome back to another video. My name is Anna Semmer, AK Bram. And it's the same Dutch. Hello, dag, hello, welcome. Which are like usually three separate words to greet someone, but I use all three here because I want to greet everyone. <laughs> uh, so in this build, uh, I created a Japanese inspired home in anticipation of the new Sims 4 Snowy Escape expansion pack, um, which I'm super excited for. Like, I can't wait. And I believe it comes out in three or four days. Um, like, uh, I want to play with it. <laughs> like, some people are mad that they're, like, reusing animation, like, rock climbing from, like, the fitness thing pack. And, like, I forgot what the hot spring's called, but, like, it's super supposedly it's, like, copied from the spa day expansion of this. Not expansion pack, but the, the pack. <laughs> uh, and I don't really understand that why, but sure. Like, it just gave them more time to, like, create new things, I suppose, so... To me, it just helps the times management, I suppose. And some people were, like, mad that they only just started adding snowboarding and skiing, like, like now, and to the different expansion pack, because apparently in The Sims 3, that came with Seasons, and I didn't really play The Sims 3, at least not with expansion packs, so I wouldn't know. So, I, at the same time, I kind of get why they're mad, but at the other time, or at the other time, on the other hand, I'm like, uh, well, they probably had some good reasons, um, but yeah, why didn't they add it, I suppose, true, but it's a completely different game, so it has different rules to do, I suppose, so it's, I know some coding, so I probably got why. <laughs> Um, but I'm so hyped for pack, and I really want to buy it, and I want to play with it, and I think I want to do all most aspects, so I have a bit of a let's play in my mind, which I want to do on YouTube, um, because I'm playing with this family in Brindleton Bay? I think so. No, not Brindleton Bay. Which one came with City Living? I don't remember. Not City Living, either. Get together. Which one came with that? I don't remember. But they have a home there, and I think they'll be going to a vacation home there first to experience how that works. And they have a daughter, so I think she'll grow up as a teenager and then start off and start a home there. Um, yeah, I think something like that that she lives on her own she moved out of her home like her parents are a bit too weird for her because her mother is like a spell casting she her her grandmother used to be a spell of her mother the mother of her mother like the daughter's grandmother she used to be spell casting which was like banished and so she took her daughter away from the spell casting world and such and now the daughter had to be recalled because there was something wrong in my mind uh and her and well, so the daughter, her father, her is like Caleb. So her mother is now a spellcaster that has to help the Glamourbrook world. And her father is a former vampire. Like, your life is kind of crazy. <laughs> so I think she would really enjoy a snowy escape. Did you see what I did there? <laughs> um, so she would first go on vacation and then probably fall in love and yeah. So it will be interesting to see how the world works with like living there in a vacation home and then moving there permanently and see what's going on. Um, it will be a little different because I'll be playing with a teenager and because of that she will have to go to school. But we'll see about that. And like, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> um, but that by this build. Uh, I was inspired by the Japanese style from this expansion pack and I tried to recreate it with the packs that I own and the base game uh, and I looked at a lot of inspiration like Japanese bedroom, Japanese living room, kitchen, everything, I looked it all up and I tried to find as many items that I could and actually the black flooring is like poss possibly wrong because in most Japanese homes that I looked at they have like light furniture and light wood floor and such and well, I went for black because in my mind it's a little bit renovated to a more modern side. 
uh, this home, a living room, a dining space, a kitchen, one bathroom, and one bedroom. So it's not too big, and yet it's still 33,000 similes or something. Oh my god. Uh, but I had a lot of fun, because I usually build a, a lot of different types of homes, like more American, Dutch and such, and uh, colonial, I think. Um, and this was like a completely different style for me, and so I was trying to make it look as um, fitting as possible, yeah. So I probably used too many packs too. I try to go. I always try to go like three to four packs, and I always end up with like ten or something. So sorry, <laughs> but if you do download at home, which you could, uh, find me in the gallery and I'll send a thirteen. Uh, but if you don't own the packs, I didn't really use a whole lot of items from the packs. You can look which items I use. So if there were like one or two, you could po probably like just download and replace with something different. Um, yeah. <laughs> so, uh, I'm at a loss for words. Oh my god. Uh, I haven't done this in a while, I'm sorry. I've, I've been busy with work because I've been scheduled in more, for more shifts. And I have had driving out a lot. I still have some driving out lessons to do. Um, I'm just trying to cope with the whole Corona and COVID-19, uh, not 13. What's COVID-19? What's COVID-13 even? Um, so I've just been a lot in my head. And I was like, I'm gonna record this video. Uh, I, I just want to like let out some creativity. I've been designing a lot too for people and such, and I just want to do something for myself too. I've also been applying for internships, and let me tell you, it's some slip, slip. It's some slim picking out there. Like a lot of companies have uh, taken back their vacancies. Um, so I can't really follow an internship at a lot of companies, and especially not the in kind of internships I'm looking for, which is difficult, which I understand too. Companies are trying to, um, what's it called? Get back up, I suppose. They're still recovering from like the financial uh, setback that COVID-19 created for them. Uh, so they're not really looking for designers, unfortunately. <laughs> More of like financial and marketing kind of internships, I suppose. Um, but I'm looking and I'm applying and I'm kind of stressing out, but sure, we'll get there. Um, and at, at this point, I'm also like, what else is there I can do? So I thought I should record a YouTube video if I'm bored because that's something I can do. I will have to record, I have to have build record at the same time, edit it, voice over it, make everything ready. So that this takes away like a couple of hours. Cause I think this build took me like one and a half to two hours probably. But I had to take some breaks too, so there's a scratch on my screen. No. That's not good. I don't even know how to got that. And I've got a message. Ooh, or somebody I want to not date with. I'll have to respond to that later. You know what I'm bad at? I like always respond to everyone like immediately. I saw people don't do that back, which I get. But I have like an Apple Watch, so I get a message on my watch, <laughs> which I will notice immediately. And like, I don't want to come over as ent enthusiastic for like someone, especially when they don't respond as often or as quick, I suppose. Uh, so sometimes I have to like set a timer for me to not respond in like 10 minutes and such I don't know if anyone else does that too but I do that uh, but yeah uh, I think at the home turned out actually really good sorry I'm jumping from one thing to the other but my voice is almost on the sound too <laughs> but I think the home turned out really well it's something completely different from what I usually build um, it is still very expensive but I just want to place it like uh, in the new world when it comes out and probably added it a bit with the new expansion pack with like split leveling and such oh my god split leveling I'm so excited for that and like the rental homes 
Ugh. I can't wait. I literally can't wait. Just a couple more days. Oh my god. Oh, oh my god. Now I'm, now I'm all hyped up and I want to play with it. But I can't. Because I ain't a EA game changer and such. Which is understandable. <laughs> but yeah. I'll let you enjoy the rest of the build and I'll give you a tour in a bit. And so this is the home. I did have to rotate it to upload it to the gallery because apparently I was building on the wrong, in the wrong direction for the lot. So, okay, let's move in. Let's move in. Let's go in. Do they not have glasses in them? Never noticed that before. Well, too bad you're getting flies in door. So this is the interior. The kitchen, this is where you would take your shoes off. Usually this would be like a split level, but sure. I think the kitchen turned out actually really clean, which is usually what they do or have. I could have possibly put in more decorations, but I didn't want it to be overpriced, and yet it's still 31,000. So I messed that up. <laughs> so yeah, if you're going to cheat your sins, then probably you could add some uh, decoration there too. The little dining space, it's not very... The kitchen and dining room is very simple. And the living room is... Ooh, let's move that plumb up away. Is I think it's cozy. It is very inviting to sit down and relax. And just... Yeah. The view here is amazing, as you can see. And then from here you go... It's very simple and straightforward. You go into the bedroom. Which I think actually turned out really good. And like the subtle p pink shade on that wall comes nicely back into like the petals of the leaves and such. And then the flowers. The bedroom is really nice. And the bathroom. Not much to say about the bathroom. And I did, as you can see, split the toilet from the bathroom because apparently they do that in Japanese homes as delicacy, Sim City. Sim City? No. Uh, little Simsy and Jim Stone and so told that they had to do because that's what the Sims required for them to do. So I copied that. And yeah, I think for a first time building a home in a Japanese kind of style, I think I did a good job. But you're probably going to tell me otherwise in the comments. And please do because I want to learn. And I love some feedback. That's what designers love feedback. Um, but sure. Yeah, yeah, not much to say about the exterior, <laughs> I suppose. <laughs> well, I'd like to thank you all for watching this video and this speed build. I hope you enjoyed, and if you liked the video, please give it a big thumbs up. Big blah, blah, blah. If you like this video, please give it a big fat thumbs up. And if you are new to this channel, subscribe down below. If you want to be notified when I upload a video, which is all up to you, press that little bell icon as well. And I hope to see you all in the next video, which will be probably about Snowy Escape. Until next time, plot scenes!